Hello everyone, this is Inspire2016. We would like to give you a free tarot card reading focusing on your love life and your relationship. This tarot card reading will give you an update of your love life, including your past, your present, and your future uh, relationship card uh, reading. So the way we laid out the card, we will draw four cards for you. So the first card will represent your past love life and the second card will represent your present conditions of your love life and then the third card will represent your future position of your love life and the last card will represent as a guidance card that represent the direction of your love life will be headed into for the next future. So I hope that you enjoy the reading and if you like the reading just click like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you. Hello Pisces, this is Inspire 2016 with your weekly love and relationship reading for the week, commencing the 4th until the 10th of July 2016. The first card for you is representing, the past position of your love life. Your card is, the world. The world is the final card of the major arcana, the completion of the fool's journey, when this card represents you in a reading, you may be finally reaching a goal that you have at times thought was out of reach forever. It could be that you have reached a point in your life where you can sit back and feel a sense of achievement. You worked hard to get here. Now is the time to enjoy the fruits of your labor. It is also a time to look back on past experiences and understand that certain people and situations were catalysts for growth. This card can also represent the bringing together of opposites, integration with others, and matters handled with integrity. This is a very positive card, a meeting of minds, problems resolved, a satisfactory outcome. So, enjoy this time. The second card for you is representing, your present love life. Your card is, the Empress. The Empress shows the birth of something in your life, whether it be a relationship, business or even a child. She represents fertility and also sexual desirability, particularly for a woman. She can also represent your own mother, or a mother figure, someone who is kind, caring and helps to guide you through life. She is the matriarch and when she appears in a spread she brings a nurturing energy. You are supported, protected and loved. In a love reading your relationship is fertile, your partner is loving and passionate. Enjoy this lovely time together. If you are hoping to conceive a child, now is the time to try. If you do not want children then perhaps you need to take some extra precautions. The third card for you is representing, the future of your love life. Your card is, the Hierophant. Also known in some decks as Faith or the Pope, spirituality and education are the mainstay of this card. You may be considering taking a new course of study or even following a new spiritual path using either your inner wisdom or a teacher in the real world. The Hierophant is also the card of the advisor and it may be that you need some professional advice at this time in your life. You are likely to be following a conventional path in your spiritual outlet, organized religion, your educational pursuit traditional college or university, or your relationship paths, traditional marriage. In a love reading this card can show that the partners are a comfort to one another and can be the advisor or guide to each other within the relationship, indicating shared faith and commitment in the eyes of the Creator. The last card for you is guidance for your love life. The guidance card for you is, the King of Air situations, you may receive valuable advice from an intelligent professional. It's important that your decisions be fair and equitable to all involved. Don't hesitate to consult an impartial party, if necessary. Yet, speak your mind with confidence. 
people, a person who's at the top of his or her field, especially in an intellectual area such as law, science, or business. Someone who's an excellent speaker and is known for his or her ability to be objective and diplomatic. Brilliant. Authoritative. Impartial. Professional. Balanced. Motivational. Additional meanings of this card, justice. A mediator. Forgetting to weigh the emotional aspects of a situation. The government or the military. I hope that you enjoy everything and if you like the reading just please click subscribe and you will get uh, instant notifications every time we publish a new video right to your uh, YouTube. Thanks.